We need to do something about cancer research, about taking care of our loved ones. We all fall into one of three categories. Either you have cancer yourself or somebody in your family has cancer, you know someone who has cancer, or in the future, you're either going to get cancer or going to get to know someone who's had cancer. Cancer doesn't travel well. The more patient-centric and convenient you can make that experience, the better it is for the patient. We've really created the largest and most integrated clinical cancer program in the state. We have had all sorts of gifts and investments of every dollar amount, from small amounts all through millions and millions of dollars. If somebody's interested in changing the course of cancer, the place to do it is here. To have a cancer center right here in the middle of New Jersey, where people can come in, get treated, it's, it's pretty remarkable. My cancer journey started in 1997. In the year 2000, it came back, and it was back again in 2002, and I had a stem cell transplant. I unfortunately failed transplant, and that's when I ran out of options. And when people around you that are experts give up on you, there's little hope. It's very difficult to travel, especially when you're going through these tragic times. We, as human beings, have to help those who may not have the ability to be able to do what some others can do. That is where the Rutgers Cancer Center really came through in just such a remarkable way. I had never come to them when I first got sick. I only came to them after I had exhausted all options. And they helped me enroll in this trial at Houston. The connection between the research and the education and the clinical care is just something that's been very, very special for us. We have a, a vision and a focus that no patient is further than 15 or 20 minutes from exceptional cancer care. We are building, in addition to the Jack and Cheryl Morris Cancer Center, two additional outpatient facilities that will be state of the art, one in Livingston, New Jersey, the other in Monmouth County. It's bench to bedside and back to the bench accordingly. People who are working in the laboratory, the same physicians, have discoveries, develop possible treatments. They can use those treatments in their patients, develop new theories about what might be good treatments, and take them back to the laboratory to be able to study them again. You naturally elevate the level of care, which is obviously just core to our mission and, and our service uh, to the community. The more patient-centric and convenient you can make that experience, the better it is for the patient, not only in terms of convenience, but in terms of actually recovering. We will change the care that they can get now, and we will change the care that the world can get in the future. My son was diagnosed with leukemia uh, 26 years ago. I didn't want to disrupt our life. It was already being turned upside down. To have a renowned cancer institute close by meant everything. The collaboration that we're going to be able to see firsthand between Cancer Institute of New Jersey, Monmouth Medical, and the expertise coming together, it's gonna to make a huge difference. Whatever way a donor chooses to have an impact and wants to have an impact, it's really exciting to be able to help them have that impact. I get really excited in being able to engage our donors in the full scope of what it is that we're doing together. I'm able to educate other people in the community about the things that Cooperman Barnabas Medical Center offers. In our family, several people have been touched by cancer, and we believe it's really important to have the state-of-the-art cancer care in our community. Till they've completely eradicated cancer, there's always going to be somebody else like me with children, with a family. We know that so many people in our communities who have been hit by cancer will want to join us in this. We can't do it by ourselves. We need philanthropic partners to come on board with us to help drive the innovation and drive the change and drive toward those better treatments, better diagnostics. Philanthropy uh, and donations to causes is really an investment in the future. We would not be able to do the things we do and make the impact we make without that kind of partnership. To be part of that is amazing. And so for me personally, for my family, there's no better way I could spend my money. Everybody can roll up their sleeves and do something. Might as well get ahead of it, get involved. To give back so that other families could experience an even better experience than we did. It'll touch your heart like nothing else can. And 
you'll be involved in something that is expanding throughout the state and we need it. I hope that others can also be part of it. And that's what we're here for is to provide for the next generation. Thank you. 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 Join us. Let's make an impact together.